Hey everybody, I am Wayland Heimer and this is Axel! Axel! And we are so glad that you are here with us this Sunday. Hey, we have a lot of really cool things happening. We're going to tell you about them. But first, if it's your first time here, make sure you text NLGUEST97000. It'll help us connect with you and get you connected to others. Hey, so we have high school graduation service, yes. a special high school graduation service on June, June 2nd, 2nd for two services. So that's the nine o'clock service and the 1045 service. I hear we have an awesome speaker for those and he's gonna have an awesome message. So you don't wanna miss that. So yes, hey, if you want to get registered or you know someone that is getting graduated, please have them email me at wayland at newlife906.com so we can get them set up for that graduation service. Hey, Dr. Nichols is here today. He's gonna to talk to us about the Holy Spirit, but if you are interested in the Holy Spirit, kind of who he is, why he's important, and all the information, we have a Holy Spirit seminar coming up June 8th from 11 a.m. to 1 p.m. It's gonna be a great time. Uh, I'm gonna be able to facilitate it and answer any questions. We're gonna have some awesome discussions. So if you have any interest about the Holy Spirit and maybe uh, discovering more about that and why it's important to the Christian life, you just need to sign up for the Holy Spirit Seminar June 8th, pronto. You can sign up on the Church Center app or on your connection card. Absolutely, and we also have water baptism Woo! coming up on June 9th. So if you are interested in getting water baptized, if it's something you've been thinking about, if it's something that you have on your heart to do, yes. make sure to reach out to the pat one of the pastors and sign up on the Connections card or the Church Center app so we can get that process started with you, go over what it means, what the importance is, and all that good stuff. So you don't want to miss that. Absolutely, absolutely. Hey, and also speaking about next steps, we have a Discover New Life class coming up very soon. June 9th during the second service, we're having the Discover New Life class. This is the class that will teach you about where we came from, where we're going, what's important to New Life, and how to start the process if you want to become a member here at New Life. So go ahead to the Discover New Life class, sign up for that. There's limited seating, not seasoning, there's limited seating June 9th during the second service. Speaking of something fun, guess what fun thing we have coming up from June 10th through the 14th? It's the snail races. The snail races are happening. Yeah, no, it's not the snail races, but it's even better. We have- Better than the snail races? Better than the snail races. We have mega sports camp coming up. That Dude, is better than snail it is. races. It's so much better. It's, it's a blast. What are the age ranges again? Well, it's first through fifth grade. First through fifth grade. If you are interested in signing your kid up for mega sports camp, which is gonna be awesome this year, sign up on the bulletin, on the connections cards, or sign up in the Church Center app. It's gonna yes. be a blast and we want you there. We, there's also a deal yes. for signing up early. If there's you an sign early up price. before, if you sign up before May 27th, there's, it's $5 less, it's $20 instead of $25. You'll want to sign up your kids pronto because there's very limited, there's a hard cap on attendance this year, so. Also, last thing we wanna let you guys know about, the Israel field trip is happening in 2025 during February. It's February 17th through the 28th. The cost to go is $2,800. That's everything included, the airfare and all of that. So if you're interested in going to the Holy Lands, which you should be, it's an incredible experience, sign up today to go on the Israel tour. Absolutely. And hey, it's been so good to see you guys here today. I hope you have an awesome, awesome Sunday. Yes. And don't forget to fill out that connections card and rip it off. Like yep, it, just like that. Just like that. And then, and then do it. And then drop it. That, that's right. In a generosity box or in the buckets as the ushers come around. Yeah, just don't don't drop it on the floor. We're not. We yeah, might, we might that, throw it out by accident. Yeah, like that, that's happened in the past. Yeah, it has. But anyway, thank you for joining us today. We hope that you have an amazing Sunday. Thank you. Yeah, absolutely. Hey, good morning, everybody. We're gonna continue to praise and worship God through our giving today. If it's your first time with us, we don't expect anything from you. We just want you to enjoy Sunday service. But if New Life is your church home and you are a follower of Jesus, I want to remind us that giving is an instrumental part of our faith that God calls us to be obedient in. I wanna call our ushers down to the front of the room as we prepare to receive our tithes and offerings this morning. Uh, I want to direct our attention once again to the gray Bibles that are in the pews in front of us. Uh, I mentioned last week about how we used part of our Kingdom Builders uh, initiative to pay for the cost of these Bibles to make them available to the church and to new believers. Uh, every single one of these Bibles runs somewhere in the range of $30 to $40 each. Uh, th think about that for just a second. 
that's not a very expensive thing to purchase at all. Uh, I, I encouraged us last week to think about how powerful and life-changing it is when we get a Bible in the hands of a new believer. The reality is for less than the cost of a date night dinner out or going to the movies and getting all the snacks, we can put this life-changing text in the hands of believers in our church and in our community. This is so remarkably true for so many things, from what we give our tithe to giving above and beyond that to kingdom builders, is that it often doesn't take much. And for even just a little bit of giving beyond our tithes, we help make a difference here in the church and all around the world. And I just want to remind us that God does amazing, amazing things with just a little bit of sacrifice and just a little bit of faith. So there's two places to give here at New Life. There's your tithes and offerings, that's your first 10%, and there is giving to kingdom builders, anything that is above and beyond. There's four ways to do that giving. It's online at newlife906.com. You can text an amount to give to 84321, drop an envelope with the ushers in just a few moments or in the generosity boxes around the church, or you can give online through the Church Center app. And if you haven't, I wanna remind you, you can set up online and recurring giving. It's fast and it's easy and it's super convenient yet. Let's pray together as we move on today. Father, we thank you for this day. We thank you for all that you bless us with. We thank you for all that you give us with. We thank you that the ability to change someone's life, the ability for you to do what you're going to do, we can help make that happen for what is comparatively so little. Uh, Lord, And we pray that you bless this offering, that this offering is used for your purposes and your kingdom and for your good. Uh, we ask that you do more than we could ever think or imagine with what we contribute to you this morning. And all God's people said, Amen. Well, once again, thank you so much for joining us. The ushers are going to make their way around and it's going to be an incredible Sunday morning.